Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So if you use Adobe Premiere Pro and you recently started seeing the error message, system compatibility report, the unsupported video driver for your Adobe Premiere Pro, uh, we'll be solving that issue, the problem in this video. It is very easy, you just need to download the recent compatible driver for your graphics card that you have. So let's take that in this video, let's get started. Okay, so as you can see, whenever I run my Adobe Premiere Pro, this is what I see. The system compatibility report, unsupported video driver for my NVIDIA GeForce RTX 2060. That's the driver I have. So what you need to do, you actually need to download the driver for the graphics card that you have. So just remember this name or whatever you have for your PC. Like from, uh, for me, I have NVIDIA GeForce RTX 2060 as the graphics card. So uh, just search on Google NVIDIA driver download. And the first link that comes up, the download drivers link, you need to click on that. Now, this website actually allows you to download the driver for your graphics card. Now, we'll be selecting the graphics card we have. So, in my case, it is GeForce. So, I'm going to select GeForce because that's what I have. And select the series, which is a 20 series. So, 2060 in my case. And I'm going to select the RTX 2060. Uh, there was an uh, option for like notebooks, but I'm not going to select that because I don't have a notebook. I have a laptop. And so uh, selecting 2060 uh, gives you next options, which is Windows 10 64 bit. That's what I have. I have a 64 bit Windows 10. And the download type is uh, by default selected as game ready driver, but uh, uh, change it to studio driver because this, this is what we're going to download. Click on search button. This is the driver that uh, NVIDIA suggests I should have on my PC. It's about 721 MB in size. And let's go ahead and download that. So again, click on the download button. You don't need to enter that email address. It's only for that uh, subscription emails. So click on the download button again. And there you go. Just go ahead and download that driver on your PC. There you go. The download has been completed. I'm now going to run the exe file. Just double click on that and select your extraction path and let it extract the file it will by default launch that uh, installer and you can currently see that my adobe premium pro is stuck on that error so let's go back to the installer and click agree and continue and yeah uh, go ahead with the default option of graphics driver in ge force experience and yeah go ahead with the express installation also meanwhile what i'm gonna do i'm gonna exit out my adobe premiere pro because i don't want the installation to you know have any compatibility issues while installing there you go the installation has been completed I don't need to launch and I don't need any desktop shortcut. So I'm just going to uncheck those options and close that. And now uh, I'm going to start my Adobe Premiere Pro again. And let's see if I face any compatibility error, unsupported driver error. And there you go. There is no error now. And this is how you fix that problem. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.